Hey guys, it's me, Patrick. Um, just figured I'd do a quick video while I've got a few minutes here. Um, I was going to show you guys my uh, 1.5 gallon here. Um, I set this up, uh, I was telling the guys there on uh, fishtanktv.com on the live chat there. Uh, you should really check it out, actually. Uh, pretty cool stuff, you know, the guys are pretty cool. Um, if you need any help, there's always somebody online that can help you, always. Uh, Dustin's always on there rocking out, you know, all the guys. Shane, uh, by the way, I thank Shane for the help with the plants. Uh, they should be here by Thursday or Friday this week. So uh, I'm pretty pumped about that. So yeah, I thank Shane, man, for the help last night with the plants. Uh, so yeah, here's my uh, 1.5 gallon. It looks like shit here on the camera. But uh, I've got a little stick there. Uh, it's from a dead tree in my yard. Uh, so I already had that. Uh, uh, I sunk that in a bucket there a while back. So, uh, but it's still anchored in the sand there, you can see. I don't know if it'll float now. It doesn't look very waterlogged yet. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty lame. I've still only got my two uh, plants. So these are clippings from my uh, Kabamba and my uh, Hygrophilia polysperma. polysperma. And uh, yeah, it's just plain old sand substrate again. Uh, but my 10 gallon will be a, you know, dirt. I'm going to gut this out soon. This looks like crap. Uh, excuse my mess here. I'm, I'm a bit messy. But yeah, here's my 1.5 gallon. I, uh, this is the Tetra Wonders tank. I took the top off it. Uh, ripped the LED light off it. I've got my uh, filter, filter here. Um, my uh, Hush 10 filter. And yeah, so uh, here it is. Uh, let me know what plants I should put in some masses. I'm planning on uh, having this as a shrimp tank, so just let me know. Alright, thanks guys.